Voyager. <clears throat> like I say, um, Voyager was uh, my decision to launch. Being Lucifer or basically the president of America or the owner of Germany, basically. I mean, I own Germany, but I mean, it's like, love you. <laughs> How's it going? Um, like I said, my Germans would, would do whatever whatever I asked, pretty much. Well, within reason, of course. I mean, whatever, you know, they, they usually, they always did whatever I asked because of the fact that, I mean, I built their country, I owned their country, I bought all their land, I also bought all of, all of Russia before there was a Russia, and then, you know, as my mining colony and everything. I mean, I built the whole planet Earth, basically. Anyway, so, but, so my people were, you know, so anyway... So, I mean, I was space flight. I was aircraft. You know, the, the American Airlines, it was American Airlines because I named America and I had aircraft. So I wanted America to have aircraft. So anyway, so I had American Airlines and my wonderful stewardesses, like I say, I love my stewardesses because they, they went through a lot for me, you know, providing that air service and all that other stuff. I mean, they went into places and they were encountered problems you know hostage situations or just physical guys you know getting a little too rough or whatever expecting them to do whatever anyway i'm talking about voyager uh anyway uh, anyway though two voyagers were launched of course i wanted one for my stuff and i forget what my stuff was i, was, I wanted some science or something i want oh no that's right i wanted it to go to one star and then no i wanted it to go out into space i think um it's supposed to go and go go by and go go to, go towards another star. Anyway, though, so I had it already planned what I wanted it what what I wanted it to do, and I was funding it, funding it. Um, and then I think uh, the uh, I left it. Uh, I think what what I, what I went ahead and let um, I wanted it to go to this one place, and I forget exactly, but basically, but basically, I um, these other people wanted to wanted to check out this other location i was like well we can launch two i mean if i have to if we're building one we might as well build two so um so i paid for the second one one as well and we probably launched more than more than two um uh space or, or voyagers basically there might even be five who knows <laughs> anyway though but i know but i paid for two of them to be launched because i wanted two of them to be launched um you know go check out some other stars so. like Anyway, so I paid for them. I might have even named them. I think I named one of them, and then the other one I let. Uh, oh, that's what it was. I let the other people name the other one or something like that. So there's there's two Voyagers, but one of them has one name and the other one has another name. So or something like that. Anyway, though, but basically I L S Lucifer Star, President of America, owner of the White House, and uh, I also own Germany. Like Germany and America were my two. You know, and Lava Tavia too. I mean, I had my favorite, my, my my favorite places. I mean, I had a few favorites where I was like, where where where, where I had been doing a lot of projects and stuff like that, and I really loved them a lot, and so I put a lot of money into them and and funded them and and also got them more resources because they needed more. So, anyway, there are certain places where there's more white buildings than the normal. I mean, certain towns have, have, have quite a few white buildings or whitewashed buildings or something like that, or, or, or white stone buildings. There's a couple of places around the world where, where you walk there and there's like 30 white buildings or something like that. It's like, why is there so many white buildings? It's like, well, that's a Lucifer white town. And I had a couple of them. Anyway, though, as town expands, you know, they kind of get submerged in the, in the, in the basically the, the abyss of what is, <laughs> what is civilization. But at first, you know, the there's there'll be like two or three buildings are that, that are used used with white stone you could actually track down some of my building projects by the stone that they used because i use a particular type of stone and all that also marble and stuff but you know a lot of them have been demoed or knocked down or something like that or destroyed in the wars or something like that anyway though i had a lot of nice stuff um anyway though but the voyagers i actually launched and i actually picked uh, the records or whatever or something like that anyway and, and how the records would be done or we had someone also uh, also take part in in be, be, because they were going to send a bunch of messages and a bunch of people listened to to the message the messages they were going to send to space and they're like no we're not going to send this so anyway so and one of the one of the records I wanted to be mine which was some music some bird songs and also some examples of languages being spoken by people. 
I believe. Stuff like that. Anyway, though, so they built two of them and they launched them to space. Anyway, and that is an LS or Brian project. Me, Lucifer, star. Anyway, creator of 800 galaxies, including the one that's coming at us. And also owner of the Earth. And also owner of America. Namer of America. And all that kind of stuff. And we're on one of my giant space clocks. So, anyway, I wanted to explore space or have space explored. So, some more. So, anyway, so they were picking two little spots and going with them out into space. So, that was me, Lucifer, Star, Brian, Bradley, Alexander. Anyway, yeah, it was my decision. It was my money. It was my people that did it and all that stuff. And basically, I funded it. I had the rockets and everything else. So, yeah, so if you're wondering who did that, that was me. Anyway, it was my decision. I, I, I chose to do it. They're my spaceships. There's a little, there's a little, surveil, there's a little satellites, though. They go to space, they look around. Anyway, I've made some other videos about this, but uh, anyway... My name right now is Alexander Lucifer Luera, but I also go by Brian Nathaniel Alexander Briley, and basically I'm Lucifer Star, the Lucifer Star, namer of America, inventor for Germany, and also lots of other stuff. Anyway, yeah, so, yep, still alive, still here, so, anyway though, but yeah, that was me, um, so, anyway. I mean, it's kind of silly, really. It's just a record. I was like, it's never going to get found by anyone. But maybe it will. Who knows? Anyway, so they so they launched them. Uh, I actually made the decision like 1980-something or other or something or 19... Anyway, but, but it was before they were launched, of course. Duh. But um, anyway, though, or whenever. Anyway, though. But then again, you know, time doesn't really have the same meaning for me or whatever. So anyway, I wanted it to be done, so it was done. And they were launched. So anyway, yeah, that's why Lucifer Star's name, me, uh, is so important. They would say Hitler or someone, but it wasn't, that wasn't any of them. It's me. It's my decision. I chose to do it. I wanted it done. <clears throat> and so they did it for me. So anyway, that was um, back, I don't know, a long time ago. So, yep. So anyway, yeah, I mean, Ro... Uh, powered armor, robots, um, the V-Pack engines, which were, I call them V, they call them V-Pack, but they were, they were LS engines, basically. So V-Pack engines, you know, these little engines, you could, four bolts, and they just stuck on the side of the, of the, of the, of the mech armor. It had like, uh, hydraulic arms and stuff like that, so it, and they go, recoilless rifles on the arms, so it go, Anyway, they weren't very effective, but they were, they, but they were cool to look at. Anyway, they built them like nineteen seven or seventeen hundred or something like that, eighteen hundred. Anyway, yeah. So I did a lot of stuff. I paid for a lot of stuff and had a lot of stuff done. I think they were in Germany or Russia or someplace like that. I don't really know exactly where they were, but they were fairly advanced. Uh, some Chinese and some Germans uh, were doing it, and they were working together to build them. I mean, it was a massive project. It was $150 million or 150 well, 1500 back then, but that's the same as, like, a lot of money. So, anyway, they built them. They worked pretty good, but anyway, yep. They should still be around. I would think they, they, they would still be in a museum or something. I mean, it was only, like, 200 years ago or 300 years ago, but I guess they got destroyed. Anyway, yeah, they were cool. They, were, they weren't that big, though. They were, like, um, smallish. There was one big one, but not that big. 